Hi, my name is Michaela Steele and I'm a freshman at Arizona State University. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use a picture editing tool called Polar Photo Editor. With this tool, you can professionally edit your pictures with filters and effects as well as crop and rotate them. I'm going to show you the simple steps for editing a picture. Let's get started. The first step that you're going to take is going into your app store. You're going to go onto the web store and in the search bar you want to search Polar Photo Editor and once you download it you're going to find it on this page and you're going to open up the app. So to get started you want to upload a picture from your computer files which you will find right right here the little folder click on that and add any picture that you want to use I will use this one and so what you can do is you can create a dynamic style um, you can also anytime while you're editing your picture you can and you like the style of it you can save that setting as a specific style so you can come back and use it later with other pictures so once you create your dynamic style, if you want to, you don't even have to. You can just use the ones that they have provided for you. Um, you if you don't want to take your time to scroll through all the options that are here, you can just simply hit the I'm feeling lucky button and it will just choose randomly choose one for you. But otherwise you can scroll through. There's a large selection of choices. Um, it's this is a simple app but it does have a lot of options for you so just scroll through that and find one that you like once you find one that you like select it um, after you've used the editing tools um, at the top you have reset zoom rotate you can center the image it's already centered you can rotate it um, if you mess up, you can reverse the changes that you made, undo, redo, and you can view the picture before you edited it and after. And this is to show the original picture. So um, anytime you're unhappy, you can restart the process and just start from scratch. Um, on the sidebar, you'll see that there's a color histogram and different, this is used to um, adjust your picture, adjust the colors on your picture. And you can also zoom, rotate, more cropping tools. Um, down here, some basic tools, uh, temperature, tint, exposure, gamma, um, contrast, you can scroll down, there's there's quite a few options over here um, saturation clarity and then as well as light and shadows there's a lot of different ways you can edit your picture but I just like sticking to the simple contrast clarity and the temperature of the picture you can see how it varies as you change that and, uh, you could just mess around with it and find a style that you like and remember if you find a certain style that you like you can save it as a setting as your own dynamic style so once you're satisfied with your picture you can hit the save button and you can access it in your computer files so that you can share it with others so to do so, I will hit first. I'm going to change a little bit the shadow. Just mess around with it, change it, make sure you're completely satisfied. You can always just save it and come back and edit it as well. So, once you're completely satisfied, you can hit save to your computer which is up here in the left hand corner save it will take a little while to load and you can rename it and save And you could also share 
If you really liked this tool, share it to Facebook or Twitter. I'm not going to do that. But thank you for watching my tutorial on how to use Polar Photo Editor. I hope this helps you out and enjoy the video and good luck editing your photos. Thank you.